Hey guys, so today I may look a little bit terrifying. I think I look a little scary, I'm just looking in the mirror now. My eyebrows are done, my base is done, my eyeshadow is done, but I do not have any eyeliner or mascara on. And that is because I'm going to be doing a review slash demo for you. And it is going to be a review of the Bourjois Liner Fature Very Long Lasting Felt Tip Eyeliner. I usually stay well away from felt tip eyeliners. All of the ones I've used in the past, all the ones I've reviewed in the past have been a bit naff. And usually you find that they dry out really quickly, they drag on the eyelid. I don't know whether I just have like really loose skinned eyelids. That sounds horrible. But like, I always feel like my eyelids are a little bit wrinklier than they should be. And I find it really hard to use felt tip liners because they just drag really badly. And also the pigmentation is usually a little bit washed out and just not as great as your usual liquid or your gel. So I usually stick with a liquid liner or a gel liner. So I decided to go to Boots to try and find a new liquid eyeliner and I was going to go for a different brand from what I usually get which is the Rimmel Glam Eyes but I just couldn't find any that I thought I trust you to do what you're meant to do. So instead, I went with a felt tip liner. And I've never tried one from Bourjois. I've tried um, a Rimmel one, a Maybelline one, and a Barry M one. And they've all been a bit meh. So I thought I would try a Bourjois one because Bourjois do some really good stuff. And I have to say, first of all, I absolutely love the packaging. I love the shape of it. It's like an hourglass shape. So it's slightly bigger at this end and a little bit bigger at the top there where the lid is. And also the pen bit is a lot bigger and not as chunky as some of the ones I've used before and also the tip is very, very pointy which is always a good thing. So the first time I used this I wasn't that impressed. I put it on and it just sort of stopped working so I don't know whether that was just because it was really new and it just had a bit of a dicky fit. But then the second time I used it, I realized how amazing this is. And before I start going into it in any more detail, I will begin with the demo. Well, hello, you're a lot closer than you were before. I'm going to use my Mac mirror thing so I can actually see what I'm doing. So I don't like to do like a cat eye kind of flick. Sometimes I'll do it a bit thinner but most of the time I'll do it quite thick on the outer and then go thinner as you go in. This is not going to be easy to do it on camera but I'm going to give it a go. But the first thing I noticed the second time I used this after the disastrous first time was that it is unbelievably pigmented. So I'm just going to do a line. And the thing I like about this as well is that you can actually feel the eyeliner going on your eye so you know it's working, like it feels a little bit wet whereas the other ones tend to be quite dry and just a bit meh and then they drag your eye so you end up with like a really bumpy line which is what I always get. So this is a lot easier to use. You can't really talk at the same time. That's not done by the way, I'm just showing you. But I just think this is a really, really good felt tip liner. Like I don't have to press really hard to get any product out, which is usually what happens because sometimes the product doesn't come out dark enough so I try and press a little bit harder but then obviously that makes that drag. But it's really, really soft, really glides onto the eye instead of just like pulling it all over the place. So I have to say, I really do love this. I'm gonna continue with this. So it doesn't look weird. That 
will do, I think. Let's not go too crazy with it. It comes out amazingly pigmented, as you can see. Usually they come out like a little bit of a washed out gray color and they just look a bit meh. So I really, really love this. It is long lasting. I have worn this many a time in work when I've been doing like eight hour shifts in really, really hot conditions. I've been running around sweating my arse off and it has stayed completely stayed I don't know it's any smudging it is amazing I think this might be my favorite eyeliner ever just because if you are a bit rubbish at doing liquid eyeliner these felt tip pens are really handy just because you literally draw on yourself but if they're dragging all over the place it can get you down even more if you're already frustrated that you can't do liquid eyeliner so i think if you are looking to practice more or you just want something that's really quick and simple definitely check out the bourgeois liner Futura. if i turn it this way can you see liner Futura eyeliner i really really like it and i'm going to leave you there and i'm going to continue with my other eye so that i don't look like a weirdo. And I will leave it there, give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed and remember to subscribe as well. I'm very close to 200, no, 1,200 subscribers. So let's get me there soon and I will see you in my next video. So goodbye. Number four, have a medical kit pre-made. So this was mine. It comes in like a little wash bag. It's always good to have. And it, I don't have like everything that I had originally in mind because I've taken some stuff out now, but I'll just show you.